Wow, and this is something I thought I did. Hello everyone, welcome to another with you video. Today we are going to be with you in Battlefront 2015's um, VR Rogue One mission. Here's the intro. In this VR mission you're playing as seem to be a new rebel. Now this is from what I look like is set after the um, droid rescues um, Jin Erso and you're trying to make your way to Yavin 4 and that's your mission. Now for the next 30 minutes um, your job is to learn how to um, to be in this environment, including learn how to save, learn how to basically protect a ship that doesn't have any defense weapons or anything. You do fight off against the Empire and you end off where um, basically Rogue One basically starts again. But what's also fantastic is just the little things like the effects, like if you look the back at you, then you'll see there's a droid there um, piloting and helping you on the way including the effects when you go through light speed that's just amazing and there's so much to it so um, now unfortunately you do need a PlayStation VR to actually work with this as of this is free but this will not work if you don't have a VR many people will say that Battlefront 2015 was a failure it could have been but because of this VR mission, it made it really better. I love this VR mission, I do. And considering that this is the only Star Wars film related on PlayStation VR, hopefully there'll be more in the coming years, I'm going to give this VR mission a 9 out of 10. Thank you guys so much for watching this with you video. Um, and I guess I will see you all on the next one. And may the force be with you.